So this is how my mornings usually start. As you could see, I'm not one of those people that jump out of bed right away. I click on snooze a few times. I then browse on Instagram, look through my messages, emails, which is such a bad habit. But yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I don't wake up and meditate and start my morning peacefully. I take my phone. That's the first thing I do. I then get out of bed eventually um, make my bed i do work out two to three times per week and it's mostly pilates so i take my gym wear my yoga mat and head to my kitchen where i always have a glass of water and then louis comes to greet me he wants to be pet but most of all he wants to be fed so he will just walk around my legs and then i ask alexa to play some music to get my morning started more often than not, it's James Bay. I'm so obsessed with his music. So Louie and I have a little dance. I pet him for a minute and then, yeah, I go ahead and feed him because he wouldn't stop meowing. <laughs> um, once I've fed him, I head to my bathroom where I don't really do any beauty treatments in the morning before my workout. I just wash my face with cold water. I don't even use any cleansers or anything, just cold water. Um, and then I jump into my gym wear. This is from a brand called Rochnist. Rochnicht. I honestly cannot pronounce that name, so I'm gonna link it below, but I'm obsessed with this. Um, workout set. It hugs you in all of the right places and feels super comfortable. Once I've dressed up, I fill up my water bottle. Always make sure to bring your own. Never buy bottled water. And note to self, I need to get a glass or a stainless steel water bottle. I then put my sneakers on, by the way, these are extremely comfortable, so I'll make sure to link them down below for you guys. And then, yeah, I head for my class, it usually lasts about 4 to 5 minutes, and it's super close to home, it's about a couple of minutes away. And then, once I'm back, the first thing I do is head to the shower to wash that sweat away. And in the shower, I'm currently using Carastas Blonde Absolute Hair Care. I really like it, it smells lovely and I don't know about you guys, but I always do two washes to make sure my hair is super clean. Um, once I get out of the shower, I towel dry my hair. If I'm not going anywhere, I usually let it air dry. So I spray in some Nivea leave-in conditioner and then take this Kahastas heat protectant leave-in cream. Even though I'm not gonna be using any heat, I, it just makes my hair very combable. Um, and then I apply my Schwarzkopf Rose Absolute Oil because it's so, so lovely. And then I do my skincare, nothing super crazy i apply some keels avocado eye treatment and then origins um, day cream with spf 40 i really really like it i slather some laneige lip sleeping mask on my lips because it's honestly the best lip balm to me uh, put some deodorant on some cozy sweats because i work from home so i don't usually dress up unless i have to go out um, and then I head to the kitchen to have some food because by that time I'm super hungry. I make my coffee with this Alpro almond milk for professionals because it tastes incredible and it froths so, so nicely. So I pour it into my frother. A lot of you guys ask where it's from. It's Philips. It's uh, Philips Senseo. And then I choose my coffee capsule for the morning. For the mornings, I like to have a stronger coffee, like 8, 9, 10 intensity. And then I'm gonna show you what I like to have for breakfast. Every day it's different, it really depends on my mood, but this is something that I love to have. 
so I toast some bread and then I grab some eggs I pretty much always have eggs in the morning some mayo um, some avocados cherry tomatoes and it's like a little ritual for me in the morning preparing breakfast I really enjoy it um, and this morning I'm doing poached eggs so I grab my um, pot add a little bit of salt apple cider vinegar um, a tablespoon of it but I usually eyeball it take my toast out once the water is boiling I do like a little whirlpool and crack the egg in the middle but you have to be very gentle because you want it to keep its shape then I take my avocados and kind of mash them with a fork um, slice up some cherry tomatoes um, add a little bit of salmon on top of my avocados sometimes Louis gets a little treat as well when I take my poached egg out of the pot I usually take a kitchen towel and pat it dry because you don't want it to be dripping with water on your toast it has to be nice and dry. I plunk it on top of my salmon, add a tablespoon of mayo, but that's optional. I just love the taste of it. Add a little bit of salt and pepper and voila, that's my breakfast. I browse while I'm eating or watch some YouTube, a TV series. But the star of this video, however, is this beautiful Philips Diamond Clean Smart Sonic Brush. This is the sound that it makes for your reference and the cool thing about it is that using Bluetooth you can sync it to an app and then it basically has the view of your mouth and um, you can set a goal. The goal that I've set for myself is whitening. So I have to brush my teeth for two minutes and it shows on an app where I need to brush and for how long. If you use too much pressure it will blink in pink color to tell you to stop doing that and then yeah uh, once i've brushed my teeth for two minutes i rinse my mouth and then it just follows your progress every day and then you have lots of different things on the app like brushing your tongue um this is what my teeth look like so far as you can see i haven't brushed them properly so i need to go back and do it again Mm, then it has like the lifespan of your brush head basically so much information on the app that you can check out uh, that's another goal you can set gum health um, fresh breath and then these are like the little uh, options that you can use deep clean tongue cleaning so then I change the brush head this is for tongue cleaning um, and then you have to brush your tongue for 20 seconds and you need to do it three times I don't always do three times 20 seconds because that takes up a lot of time in the morning who has time for that really so I only do it once that is 20 seconds and then I find it's really good for uh, scrubbing your lips but don't use pressure and then this is how you charge it you just plug it in uh, into your power socket and put it in this little glass that it comes with and then this is the travel uh, case which is so beautiful and sleek and handy and that's it uh, once I've brushed my teeth I head to my living room and I start working I check my emails and basically start my day so I hope you guys enjoy seeing my morning routine